How are you going? This is a sleepy koala and I'll be showing you how to use a GIF in Unity. But before I continue, just let me remind you that Unity doesn't support the GIF format. So we need to first convert the GIF file to a different format usable in Unity. All right, with that said, let's continue. Right, first things first, we're gonna go ahead and open our web browser as we need to convert our GIF file to an MP4 video file. So let's head over to Marshall Q's GIF converter. The link should be down below. Uh, it's pretty simple. You click the picture in the center and select your GIF file. Once it's done uploading, the conversion process is relatively fast. So you should be able to click the download button below. And show it the folder. As you can see, I've already downloaded it before. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and head over back to our GIF tutorial and just drag it in. Yep, that dragged in, we should be right to continue. Next, after selecting the MB4 video file, we're going to head over to the inspector and click the transcode toggle, then click apply. Now that we have our MP4 video file ready, let's begin putting our work into action and we can start that by right clicking in the hierarchy, hovering over 3D objects and selecting cube. You could choose whatever you want, but for the purpose of this video, I'm choosing cube. Yeah, just going to reset the transform and quickly set up the camera so we can see it better. Continuing on, we're going to now once again right click in the hierarchy, hover over the video option and select video player. Now in the inspector, we're going to make some changes. With one being, we're going to first select our video clip, make sure that's all input in. Heading over to loop, we're going to make sure that's checked. And we're going to head over to render mode and change that to material override as we are going to be using our cube. So with renderer, we're going to set that to cube and we're done. Yep, it's that simple. Let's go ahead and press play to test out what we just did. Yep, there we go. A fully functioning GIF. Yeah, with some changes. This is one of the solutions I could come up with. There is, of course, a few other ways you could do this, but I found that this is the easiest and laziest way. Yep. All sides. Right. I hope you liked the video. If you want to see more tutorials, be sure to like the video. Comment if you have any questions and subscribe to the channel. I reckon I deserve a nap after all that. Take it easy.